So what about the line pattern? If we go to line patterns, you can see that this is a list of all the different patterns that we've got. We can go ahead and create a new one or edit one that we've got. For example, the dash that we use. If we edit this, you're gonna see that you can specify what the dash distance and the space between each dash is. So if we make each dash three millimeters, it's gonna be three millimeters thick. And then the space between it is only gonna be two millimeters. But what if we wanted a tighter dash? You can see that we've actually got a dash tight here, but it's still only three millimeters thick. And then the distance between the space is a little bit smaller. So I'm gonna actually create a new line pattern and we're gonna call this dash tighter. And under the type, we're gonna make a dash. We're gonna make the value one millimeter. And then we're gonna have a space with a value of one millimeter. We'll click OK, click OK. If we go ahead and create a new line style with this dash, we can go to new line style. We're gonna call this dash uh, tighter and we'll click OK. We're gonna give this the line pattern that we just created, which is going to be dash tighter. And we're just gonna apply that, click OK, create a new detail line. And we'll make this dash tighter, wherever we've put that. And you're gonna see that that dash is now one millimeter in distance, in length, with a space of one millimeter between. If you'd like to get access to all of the course files, materials, and resources, as well as 20 hours of ad-free content, you can feel free to check out the full course on my website. I'll see you there.